some stuff from the male reproductive system, but oh, it's not everything that's on the little male model. This is obviously just a kidney. So when you look up there, that's all that's going to be on it, plus the adrenal gland in the beginning of the ureter. All right, there's the kidney. There's the adrenal gland sitting on top of it. Here's the ureter. And I've got the renal artery and renal vein down at the bottom. Do you all see the red and the blue? The red being the renal artery going in, the blue, the renal vein exiting. All right? On the inside of this kidney, notice how the kidney oh, dissects, at least in part. Do you all see that on the outside you have this area right here, on the inside you have this little area right here, and then there in the center you have a space. All right, I can stick my finger down in it. The outside is the renal cortex. This inside portion is the renal medulla, the renal pyramids, do you all see those triangular looking structures there? Those are renal pyramids which are found in the medulla. The renal sinus is the space and I'll leave off the pelvis calyx and the, and the two types of calyces, you all can scratch through those. All right. And that's about all you can see on this model right here. All right, on this guy right here, this is the only difference between this one is it's three-dimensional and not mounted. You got your two kidneys, two adrenal glands, two ureters. Here's the bladder. You have the beginning of the urethra right there. If I pull this thing out, you have the beginning of the urethra. It's going through the prostate. All right? That structure there that's sectioned is the prostate. On the back side of this, do you all see the two seminal vesicles? Mm -hmm. Those lobular looking structures. And then do you see this structure right here, this tube, mm -hmm. one on each side, that's mm -hmm. your vas or ductus deferens. Mm -hmm. The vas deferens or ductus deferens. And once again, you also are able to see the renal or vein and the renal arteries on this model. All right, red is artery, blue is vein. Because they got deoxygenated blood, oxygenated and deoxygenated blood. All right, this is the basically the same thing. Renal vein, the red ones underneath are the renal arteries. Two kidneys, two adrenals, two ureters. Notice that you've got a sectioned kidney here, just like you did on that one right there. And once again, the outer layer that doesn't have those little stripy old pieces like that is the renal cortex. Then you have the renal medulla. And you mark the renal medulla by the appearance of those pyramids. On this one over here, by the way, the pyramids are not very apparent. I wouldn't ask you about the pyramids on this one, but you can tell the medulla from the cortex, from the sinus. The sinus is the space that's in blue in that one. In this one, the sinus, again, is a little space. All right? Oh, I already did the ureters. You got two of them. Here's the bladder again. Here is the beginning of the urethra. There is the prostate. And you can see, if you turn it a little bit upside or slanty, you can see the seminal vesicles on the back side of the bladder, and you can see that vas deferens or ductus deferens right there. Most likely would not ask you those on this model. In fact, definitely won't. It's too hard to see.